Hi everyone. Welcome to Shelly's Nest. I hope everyone is doing well. We are. Some of you may know our daughter got married last week, so we have been thoroughly enjoying spending time with family here in Texas. Our video for you this week is shorter than usual. We traveled from South Carolina, where a shower was held for our daughter, to Texas to get here in time for the wedding. We didn't stay very long at any of the campgrounds so that we could make our way to Texas. This video is just going to showcase a few of the things that we were able to do. The first place we're showing you is A.H. Stevens State Park in Crawfordville, Georgia. We only stayed there one night. We happened to talk to the campground host and asked her about the tower that was behind our campsite. She said she'd be more than happy to open it up for us. So that was really a fun thing to learn more about. As a bonus, at the end of our video, we have a few pictures from the wedding if you would like to see those. This used to be a water tower back in the 1930s when the Civilian Conservation Corps built this campground, which is A.H. Stevens in Crawfordville, Georgia. We're getting ready to get a tour of the inside, and we were told that back in the 30s, it was about twice as tall, that there's actually a water tower up there. The windows is a room where people would fire watch. DeWitt is so nice going up first because he is cleaning out all the spider webs. There's Debbie coming down from the top and right underneath it is the uh, water storage. This room is where the person who was on fire watch would be able to rest a little bit during his time here. We're at Benita Lakes Park. And we're walking around the reservoir and it's 1.19 miles. And they have signs that say, no bikes. No skateboards. No rollerblades. No dogs. No horses. People only. This is our second group of turtles that we've come across on this reservoir. The first group, I was like, that is not a group of turtles. It is a log. But um, yeah, they're turtles. Hi. We're at Bonita Lakes and we found out there's bicycle trails. When we walked around the lake the other day, it said no bicycles, but we found a trail. So we're going to take it. It'll be a surprise because we don't have a map. We're riding trails around the Bonita Lake Park and the first we rode were the asphalt trails the cars were riding. Now we're driving along the gravel trails and this one looks pretty tame but there's some very steep parts that we got off and walked down or <laughs> walked up. This is my version of off-roading. <laughs> this is the type of trail we started on. I love this type. Why? Look how smooth it is. We do have a beautiful view. There were lots of views of the lake. And up here is a view of a little bit of the off-roading mountain biking, if you will. I really wish that we had a way to strap a camera to a helmet or a bicycle to show you what the trail looked like. This doesn't look too bad, but some of the trail narrowed and then it was washed out on the side. So it was a little scary, but we did it. Yay. So we wanted to make sure and give you the obligatory picture of the Canadian geese that we're seeing. Debbie's making friends with the uh, ducks. Let's see what DeWitt's doing. Thank you so much for tuning in and watching Shelly's Nest. We really appreciate your being here with us and joining us for our journey. Until next time, bye.